Now at 10, new developments in that detonation disaster in South L.A., a suspect back in jail tonight on federal charges. What we know about the suspect and the illegal fireworks stored in his backyard. Plus, dueling demonstrations over a disrobing encounter in Koreatown. Trans rights groups clash with counter-protesters in front of a popular day spa. The now viral video that sparked this chaotic scene. And packed airports, crowded freeways, the 4th of July weekend ushering a record wave of eager travelers. But the holiday getaway is being met with some sticker shock at the pump. The news at 10 starts right now. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the News at 10. I'm Rick Chambers. Good Saturday evening to you. I'm Courtney Friel. Federal authorities have a South L.A. man back in custody tonight for allegedly transporting and storing 32,000 pounds of fireworks in his backyard. Yeah, the planned detonation of some of those materials ended, of course, in disaster when they exploded into an unsuspecting neighborhood. Sandra Mitchell joins us live from South L.A. She's got the latest on that. Sandra? Yeah, it's a big 